How has the oil market changed over the last few years? I, I guess I'd bring up three things, Hannah. One is that we're a lot better at getting oil out of the ground than ever before. We're mm -hmm. drilling longer wells, fracking them a lot more intensely, so we're packing a lot more water and sand down into those wells and bringing up a lot more oil. Yeah. Uh, that brings up, I guess, the second change is that uh, in North America, we haven't built enough pipelines to get it all to market. So mm -hmm. in different places at different times, you see some really big discounts. Like Canada's got a big discount now with yeah. all our heavy oil. Mm -hmm. uh, years ago, North Dakota had a big one. Right now, it's Texas that has a huge discount to world markets. Mm -hmm. So depending on where you're investing, you kind of need to be aware of that. I guess the third big change would be the United States is now allowing exports of mm -hmm. crude and gasoline, which they never used to do. And so that has just really changed all the shipping for oil all around the world because Asia loves our oil. It's quite light. Mm -hmm. And the other thing that has done is it's meant the refineries in the United States are so profitable now. Yeah. They, their stock charts are like that. They've done really well. So that, that's what I'd say the three big changes.